Welcome to Robert Kiyosaki's The Business of the 21st Century. Robert Kiyosaki is recognized internationally as one of today's leading financial experts. The author of the best-selling Rich Dad, Poor Dad, his books have been translated into 51 languages in 109 countries and sold more than 28 million copies worldwide. Robert has spent his life educating people on how to attain financial freedom. Now, through this special video presentation, he explains why network marketing is indeed the business of the 21st century and how you can take advantage of its opportunities to create the life you desire. Hello, I'm Robert Kiyosaki, I'm the author of this book, Rich Dad, Poor Dad. I want to welcome you to the business of the 21st century. For those of you who may not be familiar with this book, uh, it was published in 1997, a self-published book, and it went all around the world. And in 2000, it made the New York Times bestseller list. It was the only self-published book that made it. And at the same time, a woman named Oprah Winfrey called and I went on her show to talk about Rich Dad, Poor Dad, and voila, suddenly I was a famous individual. So today, this book has now sold approximately 25 million copies in 100 different countries and 50 different languages. So today, Rich Dad, Poor Dad is the number one personal finance book ever written. So Rich Dad, Poor Dad is a very simple story of my two dads. My real dad was the head of education for the state of Hawaii, great guy. PhD, like I said, head of education, smart guy, but he also ran for lieutenant governor of the state of Hawaii as a Republican. Unfortunately, he lost and he ultimately died poor, so that's why I call him my poor dad. My rich dad, on the other hand, didn't finish school, but he ultimately became one of the richest men in Hawaii. So he was my best friend's father, and starting when I was just the age of nine, my rich dad began teaching me about money and business and why the rich are getting richer, and why there's this big gap between the rich and everybody else today. So Rich Dad is a very simple, true story about two fathers, Rich Dad and Poor Dad, tell their two sons about money. And it was my poor dad always said, go to school, get a job, work hard, and you know, all that stuff. And my Rich Dad says, you'll never get rich doing that, you'll never be a free man. So that's kind of the differences. But if I would show you, show you a diagram of the differences here, is that in financial education, this is very simply the difference. Because there's no financial education in our school, most people do not understand financial statements. So this here is income, expense, assets, and liability. And the reason my poor dad was poor it was very simple. Because he couldn't read a financial statement because he don't have financial education in school. He was financially illiterate, although a PhD. And my poor dad always said, our house is an asset. And my rich dad said, your father may be well educated, but he can't tell assets from liabilities. So very simply, my rich dad said to me, assets, whether you work or not, put money in your pocket. So when a banker looks at your financial statement, the banker looks at this and says, oh, you have assets and you're putting money in your pocket. And if you look at your house, it's really a liability because every month it takes money from your pocket. I can hear people say, well, it's, you know, I don't have any debt on it, but still every month you have insurance, you have upkeep and expenses to it. So very simply, the reason I'm a rich man today was I knew the difference between assets and liabilities. And I get richer and richer because every year I add more assets to my uh, balance sheet here. And so that's one of the biggest differences. And as my rich dad often said to me, he says, son, my banker has never asked me for my report card. My banker wants to see my financial statement because it's your financial statement that shows how high your financial IQ is. How smart are you with money? If you're very smart with money, the banker will give you as much money as you want because you know how to make money with money. If you're not very smart about money, all the banker will give you is a credit card and a home loan. So those are some of the differences between my rich dad and my poor dad. And if you stay tuned, you'll find out how you too can create assets instead of liabilities. Because if you're going to survive in the 21st century, you need more assets than liabilities.